Thank you for watching Critique V, uh, our third product review. And today we're going to talk about diaper bags. Yay! Okay, so should I start? Yes. Okay, so this was the first diaper bag that I got. This is a Skip Hop diaper bag. Um, I was trying to go for a theme for my kids, so the room and everything, everything had this gray uh, sort of, I don't know what you call it zigzag sort of pattern but anyways pattern. <laughs> yeah so we were going for it and and this uh this brand actually had a bag that looked like it so of course i got it um the sides have meshes so you can put bottles in there um i kind of did one bottle of for my kid and one bottle of water for me when we go out um and then there's two pockets in the front which has magnets to kind of close it so it's, it's pretty good things don't really fall out we haven't really had any issues with that there's another uh sort of zippered pocket in the front so i actually put their backup sort of clothes um, in here so it's kind of separated from everything else getting into the interior side of it there is a um kind of secret compartment if you will so you can put your wallet your cell phone when you do go out so you don't have to bring your purse or your keys uh then we get into the bigger sort of portion of the bag and there's two kind of pockets that you can put things in um, everything else is pretty like freestyle in there and then we have a back pocket so it, it worked um, the size was was decent um, you do wear it on the side so I kind of wore it like this so we haven't really had any issues um, it's easy to clean to just throw it into the wash but because of I think because of the light color you do see some staining over time, mm -hmm. um, but you can just pop that in the washer uh, and spray some of those uh, stain removers. So the, it does help, but it does wear a little quicker, I find, than some of the other bags my friends use. So full disclosure, I am a designer bag freak. So I actually originally used my LV Neverfull bag as a diaper bag, and then my friends were like, what are you doing? I was like, this is the only diaper bag I have. So anyways, I finally got a proper diaper bag, so I decided to get this one. So this is the uh, Prada diaper bag. So I am in love with this bag. So I got this off Saks Off Fifth. <laughs> and um, actually it's very useful. This whole thing's made out of line-on. And there's feet here as well. So when you put your bag on the floor, you're not scratching your bag and you're not getting it dirty. Although they're quite small and this kind of, I put a lot of stuff in here. So you can see there's kind of dirt stains already ready, but it's easy to clean up. Um, I mean, there's a front pocket, so what I do with the front pocket is I put all her towels, her bibs, her change of clothes, they're, so they're all here. So this is kind of like easy access. Um, oof, let me try to this up. Okay, and there's side pockets, so there's side pockets here. So here, what I do put here is all her cream, diaper cream, Q-tips, anything I put here. And the other side, I usually put water bottle or my water bottle. And on the back of this, what I use is my wallet or a bunch of stuff here. So I have like <laughs> her snacks. Um, anyways, I, this is what I usually put my key, my car keys, my wallet, because this is just kind of, this became my bag instead of like a diaper bag, like you said. Because <laughs> you don't want to carry a purse and a diaper bag at once. It's just way too much stuff to carry. And inside the big component. So it's a big kind of space for you to put everything in here. Um, there's a little hidden component here. So this I put in her, I have her immunization records. So then when I go to the doctor, it's always here. Um, and any kind of, I guess, important documents you put in here. Um, and yeah, so I mean, it's, it's right now it's kind of messy, but you see her wipes, her diapers. <laughs> I'll show you what I have in here, her snacks, her goldfish, her <laughs> toys. <laughs> I don't know what this is. <laughs> but I was using this, so it's a bit messy. And her, her more snacks, and her diaper changing pad, and a little garbage bag that I kind of hook onto the bag for her diapers. So like, yeah, that's it. And it's really light weighted. So, I mean, when she was younger, oh, there's a bigger strap, which I took off, but there's a bigger strap here. You can put that in your stroller, but now I just kind of carry it like this. So the strap is really long, so it fits through my thicker winter jacket as well. And I just carry this out. It's definitely a lot more stylish than the skip hop <laughs> one. Yes. <laughs> I was trying to go for a theme, so. I love my designer bags. <laughs> okay, so next, this is not really a diaper bag, but I did get this when Tristan got a little older and 
uh, when we went out, um, he had a lot of, say, yogurt um, or milk um, that needed to be kept at a certain temperature. So this was, um, what is this? Oh, the Lug. This is a Lug brand. And I got it at a warehouse sale. So this is very simple. It's pretty much a lunch bag, but it has the, um, what is this? That's a thermal, the thermal uh, liners. Yeah. So it does help keep the temperatures quite spacious and that sort of thing. Um, it has two pockets. So we have, there's one in the back. So that's where I keep some of the, um, the towels and it goes pretty deep. So it actually goes to the bottom. So you can put quite a bit of stuff in there. And then the front, um, I think I got some like wet naps and whatever random stuff. It's literally the shape of uh, the elephant. That was kind of his theme that was going on. Um, so there's really not much to put in here, but you can probably fit I guess keys in here if you really mm -hmm. had to. This was, I used this in conjunction um, with the skip hop bag, so it was two pieces that I was bringing with me. It has a little thing here I never used, but you can actually write their name. So my thinking was that when he gets a little older, he can actually use this as his, as his lunch bag. So this was, but to be honest, going out and bringing two bags was quite a hassle. So obviously I don't use this now. <laughs> So this is my last one. So this is also from Lux. So this is actually a gift from Christine <laughs> during my baby shower. So I actually use this during traveling. Oh, I forgot. So this is from the Prada bag. This is their, it came, it came with it. The diaper changing pad. Anyways, so this one, I actually traveled with this when I went to New York, which is very helpful because this came with a thicker strap. And here it was really comfortable and I kind of packed everything in here. Um, and it's very spacious. Very, very spacious, very big, and there's so many pockets you can use. So, oh, I still have stacks in here. <laughs> I'm sure they're bad by now, I should throw those out. <laughs> that was from New York last year. <laughs> You're going again this year, so. Yeah, so I'm gonna throw useful. those out, so they're probably bad by now. <laughs> Hopefully you find in diaper bags. So yeah, so I mean, there's more crap that I have in here. So, I mean, there's like three pockets, so you can put, um, Snacks, more and more snacks. So yeah, you know, you put a lot of stuff in here. Um, I think I put like her water bottles, her snack like containers, and inside there's also a hidden com um, component is here as well. You can put your passports there. Oh, that's like a thing. And you really want to put your keys or whatever. In yeah, and there's also this, which I never used because <laughs> I actually never found it. <laughs> <laughs> and here there's um, more, and then. Yeah, so what I like about this is the bottom. So this is covered by plastic, so this will prevent it from getting it dirty at all. So this is really good. So yeah, so this is uh, the, the lug as well. Yeah, I think this here is for putting shoes, so it breathes. Oh, yes. I think I use that for like diapers. I think you put it for the lot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't know what I put in there. But okay. oh yes, you know you I did. <laughs> She mentioned a latte and I kind of like, what? So the latte is my wrap in. <laughs> so I think when I was during the move, I like stuck him in here. <laughs> yeah, I remember. But I left it open. I mean, it was great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, so that's the Cypher Bike series. <laughs> okay, so this is the one I currently use. It is what everyone's kind of going towards now, the whole backpack theme. Yes. Um, so I got this through the Amazon Prime date when I think they were having like a sale and this one we love it except it's really big so uh, when we actually do try to stick at the bottom of the stroller it, it's quite hard so we actually bought two when it was the uh, Prime date thing and um, so this one we use it for Amber and the other one we use it for Tristan. Uh, they have similar concepts, so I'll just go through it, it's pretty much the same thing, but that one is slightly smaller, which uh, in my opinion is actually a better size. So this one, um, when you open the front, it has this compartment where there it's lined with those thermal sort of liners that I was showing you with the lunch bags. So you can put three bottles. Um, I currently use the uh, the uh, Dr. Brown ones. So the slender, the, and I, these are the wide ones. So I use the wide bottles. So these still fit um, very well. If you use the slender ones, they'll probably fit even better. So you can actually put all three in. And there's a pocket in the front, which I kind of put, um, you know, the formulas and whatever random thing that we might have in there. Oh, it's a random thing. We, we all have random things. So this works very well with the bottles in the front. Um, the side pocket. So this one is made with this little sliver that you're supposed to put your wipes. But 
I really don't know how you can work it out with this whole hole because unless I think I just put like a bag. You have to really push you it. You really in. have to push yeah. it, right? So I mean it's a great concept, but when we use wet wipes, you just want to this up. You know, you just pull it up. So <laughs> yeah. I mean maybe when we start using like um, clean it when they get a little older that we can just kind of pull out, but anyways it's a it's a nice yeah. feature, but I just don't know how to use it correctly. So, Tina, so the other side, that's where I put my water bottle, um, but also put like the random cloth and whatever. So it's it's very big, so this bottle isn't small and fits very well and works great. So getting into the inside of it, I'm just getting my shutters installed finally, <laughs> so you're going to see people going back and forth. Yeah. So, so it does come with a changing pad similar to her Prada bag. Um, I mean, it might be easier if I stand up and show. I actually have a lot of stuff in here right now, <laughs> but I might have to just bring it all out so that you can see the components. So I am able to fit all of this in there because it's such a big bag. Um, yeah, look, it's just like never ending. <laughs> <laughs> I carry a lot less stuff because I, I hate heavy bags. Okay, sorry, I'm still going at it. And I really like lighter bags, so I don't know if your bag is heavy at all. This one is heavy. The blue one that I have is much lighter. Uh, but, you know, I think it's a function that we really focus on today. So this one, is, there's a mesh in there. I don't know if you can see. So there's a mesh on one side. So, and then there's two pockets on the side. Uh, and then there's another zippered pocket right there. And if you really want to hook on something, it also has that um, secret hook, if you will. And the really cool thing that we do like about this one is the back. So when we go to the change room and change the kids, you can just open the, uh, the back um, instead of having to open it and then kind of dig in and look for everything. So we kind of put like our diapers at the bottom. And then this also comes with a little uh, zipper, so that's where we put in, you know, our cream and random things that we need for the change. And usually, I would I would uh, pack the bag so that the diapers are at the bottom and then the uh, changing pads at the bottom, so everything's right there. So when we open it, it's just like right there. Um, yeah. So this is. Uh, I think there's also one thing that we came with. Oh, so this bag also came with these hooks. So you can just add these hooks to the side and they can hook it to your stroller. Oh, that's interesting. So these work really well too. So we were quite happy with the bag and I think it was, uh, when we got on sale, it was probably around 30 some one dollars. So it worked well for us. And uh, the fact that it's a backpack. It's a good price point, 30 bucks. Yeah, so the, the good thing with the backpack is that when you have your kids and your hands are full, um, you don't really need, to kind of have this on your shoulder because the issue with the other bag is that I always have it on my shoulder and it keeps falling off when I'm holding my kid. So having it on the backpack, it also is better with the weight distribution. So I don't feel that I was lopsided on one side or the other. Um, so we really like this whole new, I guess, diaper bag concept that's in the backpack form. Yeah, I think I, I had one of those backpacks bags, like the one that you carry in your backpack. Um, I don't have it with me because I should let it to a friend now, uh, but she loves it. I can put a link below. I think it's called Lily J. Um, again, same concept, backpack, you can kind of wear it in like three different ways. So yeah, I'll link it below. You guys can take a look at that. Mm -hmm. So thank you for watching. Bye guys.